he kaha ke atu te pā o te mate roro, uh, mate roro ki te iwi Māori i te pā o te wa mate ki iwi ke. Koe rā tā te tākuta, a ro, a tākuta roro a Melanie Chung uri o Ngāti Rangitihi. Kā tahi anoa Chung, ka whakawhiwhia ki te kotahi i ra katirua miliona tāra e te kaunihera rangahau hauora o Aotearoa kia pai ai tana ki mirongoa mo te mate roro e kia nei ko te Huntington's disease. Ko te kaiawhina ki ngā mate aroro e mihi ana ki te hunga tautoko i te kaupapa ki te pūtea. I'd like to take this opportunity on behalf of all the Huntington's families. So thank you so much for recognising this work. It's Huntington's been... disease is something that usually you would know about because it's a genetic disease. Um, so in order for you to get the disease, your mother or your father has to have had it. Huntington's disease is misdiagnosed, misunderstood. We need to empower families. We need to... Um, promote awareness of Huntington's disease. Ko tata ki te te kautau tēnei uri o rangitihi e whaiwhai ana i ngā mahi rangahau roro. Nō nā kua nei te kaunihira rangahau haura o Aotearoa i whakawhiwhia i te kotahi miriona tāra neke atu hei āwhina ki te patu i te mate Huntington's. The great thing about this project is that it blends uh, mātauranga Māori and Western medicine together and it's driven by the Fano that have this gene and they wanted it researched. Mike and his team discovered that if you train the brain, you can change the structure and the function of the brain and that's what's really exciting for us. Hey tāna, e toru ngā momo tohu mo tēnei mate. It affects them three ways, cognitively, the way they think, emotionally, um, depression, anxiety and the movement disorder. Because of the genetic Many of our family members will not only have looked after their husband and wife, but are now looking after the second generation. E ana te kairangahau nei, ka taia tēnei mate te kaupare. As you engage the brain and you engage all the different processes, changes start to take place. But as I was saying before, you have to consistently train the brain 30 minutes a day in order to do that. I have started brain training, and particularly for my memory and my attention and my mental flexibility. And it's actually been really, really interesting about the changes that have been taking place in my brain. Hei te tau e tū mai nei, ka tū ngā whakamātautau ki Aotearoa nei, neke atu i te ono te kaunga tāngata kua pāngia ki te mate ka uru ki tēnei whakamātautau. Manawa Wright, te karere.